Welcome back, Love Nation. This is Nina. Like, share, and subscribe. Thank you to everybody that has been coming to my channel. Like this video, share this video, and hit that notification bell so you know when I drop my next one. You guys, we are going to get straight into this breaking news concerning Krishan Rock. Apparently, the courts are literally tired of her behavior especially after what she's been doing since she has been on a probation in Oklahoma. I reported on this a few days ago. However, there is now a big update. Krishan Rock is officially wanted in Oklahoma. On top of that, it seems like the courts are asking for a 30-day lockup for Krishan Rock. As she has repeatedly violated her probation, she has been racking up more cases, and she has not done her community service as Oklahoma has requested. I have documents from the court. I would also like to thank Hollywood Unlocked for some of these documents. We're going to get straight into this mess as she is now wanted and she has not turned herself in. Now, this is directly from the Oklahoma probation site for offenders. Krishan Malone is officially wanted. This is her fugitive poster. She is officially wanted for interstate probation violations. Again, this is her photo. A lot of guys has noticed that Krishan Rock has not been online, and, you know, rightfully so, if they find out where she is, she officially can be arrested and sent back to Oklahoma. We also have documents, because when she is caught, if she does not go ahead and turn herself in, she will also have to pay for being sent to Oklahoma and owe fees for that one. Again, this is her official Oklahoma wanted poster. Now to get into these documents that were filed in court. I tried to zoom in. I Excuse me if it's a little bit too fuzzy. These are the documents saying that they want her um, to be ordered to commit to at least 30 days. This was literally just filed on February 23rd of 2024 and this is saying that Krishan has failed to complete 120 hours of community service by 9 15 of 2023 as this was ordered and put into place on March 15th of last year the violation of probation for this matter concerns the 120 hours of community community service that was not fulfilled as requested by the state of Oklahoma. And this is just what the court is recommended. You guys keep in mind that the judge can actually um, make this longer if the judge so feels as if um, more time needs to be. However, the 30-day minimum is what was requested. Now to get into this document, this is a supplemental order filed by the court. And this is actually going into the issue of the violations that are being brought upon Krishan Rock as adding to her offending and what um, violated her probation concerning, I think it was Woe Vicky, as well as the James Wright situation you guys can feel free to pause this at your own lou to read is basically explaining that she also um did violations in maryland maryland specifically on august 13th of 2023 in fort washington to victoria waldrop basically known as Wo vicky and um, well, Vicky is saying that Malone put pause on her in this instance and that charges were filed against her in Maryland 
for Paul Pond, a second degree um, felony, according to Prince George, Maryland's court clerk's office, an outstanding warrant remains active for Krishan Malone. So this is explaining the whole Vicky incident. The document further on goes on to say in a little bit of detail concerning the James Wright situation. It's basically explaining that November 23rd in L.A., Krishan Rock put her paws on James Wright, and this action appears to also violate the probation. So, again, pause this, screenshot it if you guys would, would like to read a little further into this. Now, the 30 days, I just want to explain that the 30 days that was in that first document I showed you guys, that 30-day request was literally just for the 120 hours that was not yet fulfilled in Oklahoma, okay? That was the 30-day request because of the community service hours. Um, with the two incidents with Woe Vicky and James Wright, I just want to just give you guys a little bit of my legal knowledge. Um, any added time um, put on for those incidents will probably be outside of her not fulfilling the probation violation issues. So again, um, it is my own belief and I'm not a lawyer. These are just my opinions. Again, my opinions. Krishan Rock might actually be looking at more time for the physical attributes, uh, the physical cases that she got, the one from Maryland and the one from James Wright. Uh, and this is just with the Oklahoma um, probation issue. Also, she's looking at separate cases stemming from the Wolvicki incident in Maryland, that's a separate incident, as well as a separate incident from California. Okay, so she's looking at time in Oklahoma, and of course, because of the cases in Maryland and California, as of right now, she could be looking like looking at a lot of time with these cases. It is all dependent on how she pleads. Does she want a quick case? Or does she want a quick settle? Or does she want to take a plea agreement? There's a lot of moving parts with this. But honestly, none of this is looking good. She is definitely, definitely looking at spending most of 2024 wrapped up in either being in jail or having to go in and out of court in three different states, Maryland, Oklahoma, and California, because she does not know how to control herself. Again, these are all breaking developments, you guys. Right now, just on the community service hours that she was supposed to do alone, she's looking at at least... Uh, 30 days just on that alone. Okay, I just want to make sure I'm clear in saying that the James Wright situation and the Wolvicki situation are not, it does not yet seem to be factored into the 30 days that was already requested. Okay, so she's looking at multiple violations, more than likely later being added because these are in three different states. You got three different um, states that have to communicate with each other. So, yeah, she's definitely looking at a lot of issue here. And again, I've said this time and time again. Uh, the only person that's really going to hurt in this situation is the child. Blueface is already serving six months. So, just wanted to update you guys on Krishan Malone. Rock's situation, what do you guys think about her facing this jail time? Share your comments below, like, share, subscribe. Till next time, 
Bye, guys.